I'll get the next after. Yes, make yourself useful. I have to do everything around here. We have to. I want dad. I know. I miss dad too. Good. Next scene. Emma, what did you do with my robot I made? Nothing. Yes, you did, Emma. Tell me where it is. I'm not gonna tell you. Mom, Emma stole my robot. Okay, okay, I'll tell you. Good. I love it. Finally, good actors. I'm gonna get in contact with the agents. Well, go. <laughs> Next. Hello, I'm Scott and I'm from Scotland and I will be showing you the traditional Scottish dance. But don't you like my dance? No.
this time, also known as our guessers. This is Mike, and this is John, and here are our contestants. This is Madison. How old are you now? Ten. So you've wanted to be an actor for seven years? Yes. Next guest is Shelby. Shelby, what do you want to be when you grow up? I want to be an astronaut. Why do you want to be an astronaut? Because I want to go into space and I want to be the first person to go on Mars. Why Mars? Why not Jupiter? Well, I don't think you can really land on Jupiter. My next guest is David. Now David, what do you want to be when you grow up? Well, what I want to be when I grow up is probably an actor. Why do you want to be an actor? Well, I want to be an actor because I get to express myself, and when I'm not expressing myself, I don't feel as confident as I normally do. Here's our next guest, Emma. Emma, what do you want to be when you grow up? A dancer. Why do you want to be a dancer? Because it's so much fun. Who is your favorite dancer? Um, my mom. What kind of music do you like dancing to? I mean, why do you want to be a dancer? Because it's so much fun, and I like it, and I like to wear costumes when I dance. And it's like, it's really fun when you get to show off your dance moves. How long have you wanted to be a dancer? Um, five years. How old are you now? Five. So you for the, so for your whole life. All right, thank you for joining us today. All right, now my next guest is Dustin. Now Dustin, what do you want to be when you grow up? Well, I want to be a director, producer, and an actor. All right, why do you want to be a director? One, it's, instead of being just an actor, 
and just expressing your feelings and everything, it, it teaches you behind the scenes. It gives you a new perspective on filmmaking and just the all-around basis of making a movie. Thank you for joining us today, Dustin. And now that's all the time we have today. We've heard some very interesting things on what we want to grow up. Thanks for joining us. Join us next time. Are you looking for a place to take horseback riding lessons? If you are, you can always come to Sally and Susie's awesome and amazing horseback riding place. Now let's listen to our satisfying customers. The first day I got there, I got bit on the butt by a pony. The first time I got there, I got bucked off as soon as I got on. I want a refund. As you can see, most of our customers are all satisfied. And it's only $99.99 for your first lesson. And remember, no, no refunds. Is your house too cold? Bank it too small? Then try our new puffy pillow! Look at our satisfied customers. I hate it, it's horrible. It's itchy, gives me rashes. Call us now before it's too late. It's behind the scenes.
go, 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 go. My baby, we can go la ba da ba ba Okay. Yeah. If that you one. feel that way, I understand. But this is you got to try on different hats because you're learning. If you learn to write a scene, you're going to be a better actor. It's going to help you be a better actor. You're going to understand it, the scene better. You're going to understand how things flow. So I want you to do commercials and, or a scene. Pick one or the other. So you, do, uh, you could do. What if I? What if you do like a snuggle pillow? Oh, woo, and you're like, not only does it, you know, and then, so like, and then it gives you something. Look at these, look at these, look at these <laughs> satisfying <laughs> customers, and then it has like people, but they don't really like it. It's like it's itchy and stuff. So, <laughs> guys, why don't we focus on commercials? Okay? Because I can do a game show. A game uh, show. <laughs> you can put a buzz in if you know the answer. Action. Game show. Action. Away. Two, one, action. Okay, the room is clean. Have a good night. <laughs> Happy, Happy birthday! birthday. Oh, thank you! Oh, thank you guys! I tried. I'm going in. Boom, boom. Wait, it's like a triangle. It's kind of like a triangle. Let me just do the other thing. Come in, come in. It's flying There's a fire starting in my heart, reaching the fever pitch and bring me out the dark. Finally, I can see you crystal clear. Go underestimate the things that I will do. How's Joy Kids? Awesome. I love it. I'm sad that I, it's almost over. It is so sad. It is. What'd you learn from Joy Kids? I Joy Kids had to act, sing, focus, and everything. Well, I love the teachers. Aw, we love you. <laughs> what did you learn about Joy Kids? That dressing up is fun. <laughs> what did you dress up as? A crazy person! <laughs> what did you learn? Did you learn anything, my child? Say yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Hello, what's your name? You don't have a name. I learned how to act, direct, and film. What did you learn? Not to be cautious when everything is going on because so you know whether or not you have to take the take again or just all the, all the uh, little details that everything revolves around because if you have someone's cell phone go off then you have to redo the entire scene so just those little details that's I learned were more most important